Good morning, Hero Wars fans. When it comes to tanks in Hero Wars, Astroth, Ziri, and Aurora are the heroes in the tank category. Depending on your opponent, you can use special heroes such as Kark Tank, Dantre Tank, and Vari Tank, and so on, but the topic of this article is Yasmin Tank. For those of you who have been playing this game for a while, the term Yasmin Tank may sound strange to you. Even though Yasmin is very good at dodge, you may wonder what kind of tactics she uses to fight in the front row of the team formation. However, I was killed by a team of Yasmin tanks in a defensive battle in the arena yesterday. Hmm, a humiliating defeat indeed. As I've mentioned many times in this video channel, no matter how many half-developed heroes you put together, they'll never have an advantage in battle. Heroes must be trained to their maximum potential to show their true value. This opponent is well aware of this fact, and has well-balanced training of the other four heroes. If you are spotted in the arena by a skilled player like this, you will be attacked relentlessly every day, and you will become a sitting duck. I'll explain my opponent's team composition. Yasmin has good critical hit and dodge abilities, but her physical attack power is quite average. And if King Mao's artifact number 1, Armor Penetration, is activated, Yasmin will also have the Armor Penetration status. Furthermore, Sebastian's skills 2 and 3 can increase the critical hit status of his allies, which will amplify Yasmin's combat power. Then, if I use Celeste's skill to make the Cursed Flame appear and interfere with Astroth's revive skill, my team will be off to the other side in a flash. Thus, if I am challenged with the most optimal team composition, there is a strong possibility that I will lose. And Vari is the most famous hero against Kark, but if you have a good combination of heroes other than Anvari, like this player, you can kill your opponent's Kark in seconds. In the case of my Astroth, he has a weakness in defense due to the fact that he hasn't finished training his artifact number 2 and his skin. I believe that in a few months I will be able to counter this teaming of the enemy, so I will continue to train my heroes, looking forward to that time when I can. I'm keeping a notebook of the names of opponents I've suffered humiliating defeats against, and I plan to revisit them in the future with that notebook in mind. Everyone has their own way of enjoying hero wars, but in my case, I make it a point of life to double down on the humiliations I've suffered. Ha ha! Well, as far as this arena defense is concerned, I have to say that my opponent, who combined the characteristics of heroes well, was one step ahead of me, and I was completely defeated. I've been chatting with my opponent for a while now, so it's not like I'm holding a grudge against him in any weird way, so please don't misunderstand me on that point. Now, it's time for the video to end. If you're interested in learning more about Yasmin, please subscribe to my channel. Thank you very much for watching the video until the last part. I'll see you in my next video.